I'm on the swing. Hi, everybody. I'm going to just do a really impromptu tour outside, letting you see some of the plants I just bought and a few of them that we've planted already. But in doing so, I'm also going to be showing you the unfinished areas of the pool. Um, that way, when it's all said and done, you kind of have a before and an after. So if you're up for a little walk, come join me now. Thanks for coming, by the way. And if you're new, I hope you'll consider subscribing. Would you all give me a like? I'd appreciate it so much. One thing, I'm so sorry I didn't get out here yesterday or the day before. I finally noticed that our magnolia was blooming and now it's a little, well, they're actually closed up a little. There's like three blooms on there. They were so much whiter yesterday. And I think there's one on the other side. This is a little gem, Magnolia. And I was worried. Now we do have some kind of critter on there. I need to take a picture of that sucker. Um, that's eating holes in the bottom. Not on this tree, but on the other one. I don't see any damage yet on this one. Um, our fountain needs water. So if you hear a noise, it's because it's pulling nothing. That fountain, you know, I've already told you guys it was my mom and dad's, but it has a leak in it. We haven't been able to repair it. So today I bought these. It says Dark Horse, I'm not sure how to say things, Wigella. So it says full sun. I don't think it's going to get full sun over here. It's already past bloom, but you can see the color that it'll be. And those are azaleas. They're past bloom as well. I have flocks here, past bloom. Um, we're going to bring, we have a mountain of rocks over there. We own them all. <laughs> We've paid for them, so we're going to find ways to use them. We just got to pay people to put them in. But I have one on the opposite side over there, and I'm, I'm doing very symmetrical. So there's going to be a rock right here. And then I bought... I'm, I'm pretty sure I should I should look before I say it, but pretty sure that the cone flower is the the flower, the state flower from Missouri. I love a cone flower. I'll show you some that are a little bigger, but I put six in here. I was going to do two rows, and as I brought them out and started following the curve, this kind of worked out. So, but that's a well, let me get out of the. It's a really pretty one. I love that. It is so gorgeous. So I picked up half of them at Lowe's and half of them at a nursery. Um, I have two types of azaleas here. You can kind of tell the difference in the leaves. This one in the front is a little flowier. And then um, I think the ones right around the, it's odd, one of them's blooming over there. I'll show you in a minute. I do not remember what these are. I feel terrible. And I saw some more of them today. They're gorgeous. I love the texture on the leaf, but look at the flower. It's it's such an unusual shape even itself. So we planted those. This I got, I, I don't know if I gave this, if this is ours or I had given it to my father. Regardless, it's, it was, to, I guess it was to hang on the wall, but when I looked at it, it was like, you know, I think that would look pretty in our garden. So I don't know if you can read it, but it's like the names of Jesus. I love that. What else have we got? Oh, just the rest of it over here. So let me take you out to the shady area and show you what we're planting. I'll just kind of take you around. Yeah, we've got a little weeding to do. Haven't seen, I shouldn't have sent this, but we haven't seen any snakes <laughs> since the last time I came out here with you guys. So this is a huge shaded area. It's gonna take us a while. I don't ever wanna completely fill it up. Um, I love it. I want a sporadic, um, sporadically planted things, but I got heliotrope. I think that's how you say it, which is a color purple. And there were only two at the um, garden. So I got that one, and then I put one over there. Isn't this wild? These grow up by the trees all the time around here. <clears throat> I don't know. I think we're just going to let it go and see what happens. And then this ground cover, which 
I just love that. I love it. It comes in a deeper pink too, but I really loved the color. Let me get out of here. I'm barefooted because it was like really hot and I came home and put my swimming suit on so I could go swimming, which I haven't done yet, but Okay, I hope you don't mind the walk. I mean, this is, I'll show you my property a little bit, see? Um, we go, we go down the hill quite a bit down there. I mean, into the trees. That's our playground for the grandkids. They love that. And there's that. Oh, there were some other plants on the other side, but maybe I'll come back to it. Um, we're waiting for our landscapers to show up. They, when they came back out and did everything, they said it'd be like three weeks and it's already been three weeks. I wonder what that is. Do you think that's the tree? Cause the tree died. You think that's the tree growing again? That's a hydrangea tree, I think. There's gonna be miniature lilacs in here. And I'll just give you a little update. We got those at uh, Lowe's this year and just their cannas and you know small petunias and things. Um, that's a blueberry bush right there. This needs to be planted. Um, wow my parsley is going crazy. I need to cut some of that. The basil looks beautiful. Oh now wait a minute. I, I get mixed up on who's cilantro and who's parsley. I think this is cilantro. If I'm wrong, tell me. That looks terrible. These, the sage looks bad. I don't re even remember. I've got it written in there what it is. These guys, this is so sad. I went, these look pretty sad. I, I thought I was buying the same one, but I really like that one better. Hmm, they're all lavender. This is obviously a different one. And these aren't doing great. I have a feeling they're supposed to be in the sun. If they don't start doing better, things are doing great over here. I mean, these were just about dead and they're doing wonderful. They don't even get that much sun. Um, and this is doing amazing. This is something new. You guys, isn't this gorgeous? <clears throat> so it is metal, but thin. <clears throat> and I got it and it's fake as far as the plants. They're just stuffed in there. I got it at a little, there's a whole row of antique shops. It's not an antique shop though. It's, uh, this one is, it's called Bloomland and it's just home decor. Um, so nothing that's doing okay. All right, nothing's going on on the screen porch. Let's go down by the pool. My husband's painting some, oh, they look good. He's painting some chairs that we've had for, boy, four years that really, really faded. Oh, it looks like he's painting the table too. Good for him. So there's the chairs he just painted. <clears throat> when we were moving from the house that, our last house in Lake St. Louis, I had at least three people stop and ask if they could buy our table and chairs it was beautiful it's that color there the 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 seats are a little faded but we have a umbrella over there that matches it and oh yeah that's pretty rusted over there so he's making this pretty to go down below oh for me to take you i have to go through our construction fence i said i wasn't going to do this but obviously i'm doing it this is a new addition. This is, um, we picked this up at Lowe's. It's hinged and I love that. It pops open, it's pool, pool toys. <laughs> it's a mess, but, and you can lock it too. And we've just got stuff drying over there. The hot tub. Um, our kids got us a towel warmer for Christmas for out here which is fun in the um, winter. Don't need it now. And they just installed, let me back up so you can see it. They just installed the shower. Now we've had the, the shower 
it's around out here for a while. We got this at Home Depot and there it is. There's a little drain, but it could also serve as a changing room if somebody wants to change. And then they installed our sink, our outdoor sink. So this is, I don't know, it feels kind of, well, no, it's not plastic. Maybe part of it is, I have no idea. This part is plastic here and then this is not, that's, that's metal. Um, I actually bought that on Amazon, probably all of it. And then I already had these, one of our guests left their coverall. But uh, I also had a second, I think, I don't know what it was, a seashell, I think, of the metal, but it didn't have the screws. So we're gonna get some more. We're thinking of putting a bar in here, like probably, I don't know, I can't say. We've got to figure it out, but it's just nice to have a drink station. Okay, I'm going to turn you around and let you see. Well, it's kind of a mess, but because I've got cushions out here. So this is under the deck, and we bought these. They're rockers. Um, these are just pillows I had, in fact. They're all upside down. And they came as a set of three. So you got the little table and then the two chairs. Um, oh, and this is new. My husband just bought that. I think it's really pretty. That is one of the prettiest and it's on wheels so it's easy to move from spot to spot. So we have three sets of these and I think those were my mom and dad's. We've got things in there that probably require sunlight so there's no blooms on them, which is bad. We need to move them out there and move some of the other stuff in here probably. Our kids gave this to us for Christmas. So we've got that. And then this was in the room, the Ralph Lauren room. This was the way I was going with it last year. I have all kinds of stuff to match it, but I, did, I wasn't feeling it this year. So we moved this out here. And while this looks like a mess, uh, it's just because there's usually a worker here every day. Um, our grill just bit the dust. This is uh, not a black stone. We've had this grill for years down by the pool. It just does a whole lot of meat all at once. And I can't take you down there right now because I don't have shoes on, but I can kind of look over the edge. Oh, and my husband started our garden down there. He took the kids down. We've got some cute pictures that I'll try to insert here. Um, and they all helped plant. And <clears throat> so this is, oh gosh, the guy's got his ladder in the water down there. So right now he's working on finishing this tile here, which I guess he has to do a lot of math because it's taken him two weeks to get, <laughs> get from here to there, but he didn't come today. And then they're gonna put some concrete up to about there. And the fence is gonna go all the way over. And there's a huge drop off back there, as you can kind of see. So we'll have a fence. It'll only be a three foot fence to keep people from falling. Um, and then I don't know if you can see, but there's water down there. So the water, when the, when the pool's on, the water goes over the side waterfall if we turn that part on and then we have uh, little fountains here that, that go. Gosh, I'm gonna walk in here just to get my feet wet because I stepped in stuff. So, gosh, the pool, the view, it is so beautiful. One of our favorite spots. It looks a little junky right now. This was us moving things around to stay in the shade for the baby last week. We have you know, we had a seven week old here and then a two year old. So we've got a lot of stuff out still, 
But if you're sitting in these chairs, that's that's the beautiful view. Oh, it is so lovely. Okay, what else? Oh, well, you guys hadn't seen these. I should start over there, but looks like they could use a little water. So I got these already put together at Lowe's and in the pots. So I think that's really cute. And then I meant to have them two. I didn't mean them to look like this. My husband put them out. I wanted one of each kind on each side instead of the way. But this is my favorite one. They just didn't have enough of them or I'd have bought these. They're gorgeous. And then we had one that was un, uh, unlike the rest over here. And here's those um, umbrellas I was talking about. So we're going to go with the lime green um, cushions here. I haven't bought any new pillows. And then the lime green cushions there. Um, and this is where the stairs are going to be put in, hopefully Friday. Down here. And then that takes you to that huge patio. It may not look like it's big, but it really is. Um, and then we planted um, all these coleus. There's some primrose. They're not doing so hot. Coleus are doing great, and I just bought these cannas, which have a bright red, red to pink. I don't know the color, but I bought six of those today. And I'll take you upstairs to, the deck is a mess, but I'll show it to you. Oh, and you guys, see that orange thing? Well, they were supposed to be blue for one thing. Uh, but we didn't open them for two years because we bought them thinking we were moving in sooner than we did. So that's unfortunate. Those are the most comfortable thing ever. Honestly, everybody that gets in them doesn't want to give them up. We have two of them. I got those probably on overstock. But what I find out is when I find something on another um, platform, if I Google that same name, I end up with finding it on Amazon. All right, so right now, because we had a whole lot of people here, usually these tables are separated and go in the opposite direction, but it was just perfect and still is because you just come out the kitchen and here you are sitting overlooking the pool and the view. And we have uh, Sonos, which is um, like a, uh, music throughout our house and it's also outside so um, typically if we're out here enjoying ourselves we've got some tunes going which I like to use Kokomo station you know on Pandora I make it up <laughs> um, yeah nothing else this looks kind of nasty right now it's not nasty but it's not that great leftover furniture just propped everywhere um, but I'm gonna take you outside we can kind of consider this a before, right? So are we enjoying this? Yes. Have we built a fire in it? No. I don't know why my husband did this the other day, but he built a fire in the driveway with a fire pit instead of here for the kids to do s'mores. This is a, one of our favorite places to sit in the evening. Well, it was until the pool got done. I don't know. It can go either way. Um, and the pool lights are set to come on automatically at, at seven every night. And nothing's really going on here. I'm showing you my porch, but I haven't done anything different with my doors, so I'm not even going up. I did buy new pillows there. But I'm going to take you over and show you some of my gorgeous... I've got to cut some of those off. They're perfect for drying right now. Um, oh my. So we got to plant these. We're waiting for the sun to get a little less intense. I'm gonna plant those around that magnolia tree, uh, not hydrangea tree. And then what else is going on? We planted some, I'm gonna say it's clematis, but now I don't remember there. And golly, what are these? I forgot. You guys are all so good at telling me what things are. I always try and leave the the little information in here. I have it, I think I have it in my garden spot. 
And then we put um, one of these on each side. Um, we're waiting for our lilac bushes to come in here, the big ones. They're the double bloomers. And then we planted a little ground cover right there so that it'll start to drapes over. And then all of this is gonna get um, sod, except for down here, we're gonna have more mulch and plant some flowers. So that's it. That's it, you guys. I hope you enjoyed that little in progress of the outside of the house. And I hope you uh, will give me a like, share it if you can. Um, and if you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing and be sure and press that all on the notification bell. Links are below. So if you're on the television, you're not gonna see the links ever. Open up your phone, open up a laptop, and in the browser, go to YouTube and search um, your home, your happy place. You do not need to be a YouTube subscriber to see my links. Um, but in order to subscribe or to press a like, um, YouTube wants to know who you are. So you have to have a YouTube account, which is not a big deal. Um, you just complete like your name and something. I really don't know. It's been so long since I've done it. Um, if you have a Gmail, you pretty much are on it, but okay, you guys come back and see me soon. And until then, make your home your happy place. Bye. <laughs>